Okay, today I want to make zucchini muffins. So I have three eggs. And I'm going to add two cups of zucchini grated. And you want to leave the green on, because then you can see the little green stuff. Flakes. cups of sugar, brown. You know what, I forgot an ingredient. Okay, so half a cup of vegetable oil. And you want to use corn oil. I don't like canola because it has like a fishy smell. Um, taste that too. Um, you know what, it's also good to use um, coconut oil. Just melt it up a little bit and it comes out great. And it's, coconut oil is amazing. Right now it's inflammatory. Uh, properties. Okay, I'm gonna mix it. I'm gonna add half a big, half a teaspoon of baking soda. I want a baking powder. And I'm gonna add two teaspoons of cinnamon. This makes it so good. Make sure it smells. Uh, one cup of walnuts, and these are good for your brain. See how it looks like your brain? They're good for your kids, so. I like to make muffins instead of um, a bread because it takes less time to bake, and then you have more crunchy surface to munch on. And then you can also make mini ones if you have, if you have to take them to school or something. I usually like to take some of those. Make some of these. You're gonna mix in your baking powder and your baking soda to your flour. And instead of sifting, I like using a whisk because it's fast. There it goes. And that's two cups of flour. You mix in. And your kids can do this. My daughter makes this from start to finish, so it's super easy to make. It's just. All you need is a spatula and a whisk. It has tons of veggies and nuts. And it's not too sweet because um, the cinnamon makes up for all the sweetness. Okay, so it's been 20 minutes, if, and I've turned it up to 400. If you're making mini ones, uh, bake them at 350. But if you're making um, big go. ones, 400. They'll just steam up and they'll they get soft in the bottom. Okay, hopefully you can make them because they're super easy to make. Okay, thank you.